clamp card is a circuit board style piece that attaches to a lightsaber's activation box. So a clamp card is most commonly associated with original trilogy lightsabers, especially the graphic style lightsaber or the Skywalker lightsaber. And it's considered to be a greebly as well. So a greebly is sort of an add-on piece or a garnish to the lightsaber. And clamp cards are intended to serve as the kind of activation plate, but sometimes you'll have lightsabers where the clamp card doesn't function, so the button to actually turn on the lightsaber will be separate. In the case of the Force FX lightsabers, this is functional. You slide it to turn on the saber, but in the case of other sabers, there may be a separate AV switch or some other type of switch to actually activate the lightsaber. So it really depends on what you're looking for. Now, clamp cards, probably the most famous clamp card uh, manufacturer is Sloth Furnace. And there are several other sellers that do clamp cards as well. Skywampa is another one out of the UK. And the clamp cards I have here are from One Replicas. So you do have different people making them. But they're a pretty popular, pretty common lightsaber accessory. And you do want to make sure you size them correctly. For example, these One Replicas clamp cards are designed specifically for the One Replicas lightsabers which are a bit smaller, so you always want to check into the size there. But they're a pretty neat feature, and although a lot of people go for the kind of movie-style clamp cards, there are quite a variety of clamp card styles out there. And if you look at the Sloth Furnace website alone, for example, there are many different designs. So anyway, there are also many different price ranges, so you can spend a little bit on a clamp card or a lot. So a clamp card, the cheapest one I think I've seen is maybe $5. Um, it's this one actually, this Anakin Skywalker type clamp card, and this is from One Replicas. Otherwise, a lot of clamp cards will be $10, $20. They can actually shoot way up in price beyond that too. So it's kind of like everything with this hobby, right? You can spend a little amount of money or you can end up spending a lot of money for something that is highly customized or just uses very good materials. But anyway, that's just a clamp card in a nutshell.